So most people think that hiring is very important, but they don't actually spend two, three hours a day calling everyone they know, incenting the current employees to refer other employees, you know, being very aggressive. You, you can't do what other people do. You've got to do more. And so I interview every, one person at least every single day, and I have for the last five years. It's that important. In the last year, obviously, the economy has taken a downturn, and some sectors are feeling it more than others. Uh, most of our businesses, we haven't made any radical changes because they're so small that they're still growing and they're not impacted by that. When you have a big share of market and the market goes down, then you can't avoid it. When you're very small, you can keep growing. Business Insider, for example, which relies on advertising, you know, revenues have doubled since January, and it's at an all-time peak um, because we can take share of market away from larger players. Uh, Gilt is a company that really is benefits probably when the economy is down because we're selling clothes at a discount. Um, but I think it's, it's not easy for anyone and uh, it's hard to get companies to make big capital expenditures and, it's, and advertising is tougher in general. I think in the last 12 years um, I've spent a lot of time in the internet and probably have a broader background and deeper background than most people in the internet space. So I think now, hopefully, I'm able to use those relationships, use that experience um, to, to help the companies that I've, that I've started. Um, and luckily, we've, uh, we've done well. Uh, we, was four years ago, we started with just two of us. And today, overall, in my companies, we have about 350 people, um, despite the downturn. So that, that feels good so far. Running an internet business today um, is mostly similar to running a business in the 90s, but there are some key differences. One, the cost of launching a company has, has gone down dramatically. You know, in the first couple of years of DoubleClick, we spent probably $150 million just on servers and technology. That those same servers today would cost probably $5 million. So the cost of technology has gone down a lot. Um, there's a little bit less hype, um, but there's a lot more experience. So people who want to work in the internet now want to work for the right reasons, not just because they heard it was really exciting, but because they feel it's faster moving and the fundamental trends are better today, especially compared to traditional media, than they were 10 years ago.